lot of YouTube, y'all get to see this, but the stream don't because I gave up on the stream. Because we had to do something over here. We had to find a way into the Vortex Club, which I think I found it. I feel like I'm in some kind of dream nightmare. I talked to this girl again, like we did on the stream. Three hours trying to get. In Excuse there. me, but Ridiculous. I'm going in. Sorry, but this is the VIP section. Members only. Okay. I don't give a shit about being a member. I just want to talk Victoria to Victoria specifically told me not to let you in. Nice try. Too bad you're not a member. Listen. No, you listen. Courtney is supposed to be the VIP gatekeeper, not me. So please go. Damn. I need to find a way to enter this bull. God, are you mental? You can't come in. Now we gotta try and talk to Courtney, which is which she's just over here. Do these drunken dancing needs to get out of the way? Hey Courtney, how are you? Uh what is Max Caulfield doing at a vortex club party? <laughs> it really must be the end of the world. <laughs> get it? But seriously, like, what do you want? I didn't want to be alone tonight after this week, so I thought it'd be nice to hang out in the VIP section. Yeah, we talk yes, it is her. very nice. If you're in the Vortex Club, which you're not and will never be. So, excuse me. Great plan, Max. Time to find another way into the VIP section. So maybe if we talked to them more often in the earlier episodes, we could have gotten it in that way, but... Should we just push this in? I am dumb for not noticing this. Whoa, whoa, what the fuck is going on? Well, you see the music stopped. Okay, okay, whoa, whoa, who stopped the music, okay? DJ, what the fuck? <coughs> Now we, now we're in the vortex club through this way. Now look at that. I don't know why I didn't figure that out sooner. Nathan is the vortex club, so his ass has to be here tonight. We have a mystery, Kate. Thank you so much for coming by, Max. You looked in my heart. Kate, I was so happy to see you smile again. You mean so much to me. And to so many others, I have to go. But I always wanted to say, hey, have fun at the movies with Warren. He's so sweet. He bought bought by some school books I needed. Give him a hug for me. I will. Oh, excuse me. I will soon. I will call me as soon as you can. That VIP section is so you lame. You guys worse than I my dad. Like Kate Marshall yes, Vortex but can he do this? For all this shit. I feel so okay. I don't know if Victoria is next or Nick. Sorry, Max. Vortex Club members only. Sorry. I'm on the guest list. I'm taking you off. Go fuck yourself, me, Victoria. I don't have time for this bullshit. Real cute, Max. And after I apologized to you the other day. Do you even have a clue what's going on at Blackwell? Yeah, Kate Marsh tried to kill herself in front of you. And me. Everybody here. That's not my fault, Max. Don't you even try to blame me. Nathan. I blame Nathan for dosing Kate, but nobody at the <coughs> even cared she was so wasted. It's a fucking party! Everybody is wasted! What do you want from me? Some humanity, Victoria. 
Well, you got Nathan busted out of Blackwell, so you should be happy. And I'm the only person here who cares what Nathan is going through. This is bigger than a problem, child. I'm it not really perfect, is. okay? I'm a teenager at an art school. I'm only here to become a photographer and get famous. You have talent, Victoria. You don't have to push people out of your way. You don't understand. My parents own a gallery. I know how this art game has to be played. It's brutal. No, it's it's art. You don't have to play their way. Mr. Jefferson doesn't talk that way, and and he's famous. On point, Max. <coughs> Thanks for admitting again that I have some talent. Not that I think I always do. I don't either, but that's the choice you make. Hard to believe, but I don't always make the best choices. No Do you does. think it's like fate we're not supposed to be friends? Why the hell not? We're both into art and photography. We're both kind of weird and pretentious. If we hung out with our attitude, we'd get along fine. I almost asked you to hang out. You said my photos were Abaddon-esque. Then I remembered who I was. You should have asked me. It would have been cool to compare photo notes. Maybe we're too much alike. You might be right. Well, Max Caulfield, there's still time for you to get in the Vortex Club. I actually hope so, Victoria. Why do you say it like that? Warn her. We're warning her. Victoria, listen to me. Your life is in serious danger. Glitches. I know Nathan is your friend, but he is truly unstable and dangerous. He Look at did these glitches. He that party so he could take her someplace dark. What? Nice try, Max. But I don't believe you. And why would he do that? That I don't know yet. But it was enough to make Kate want to die. This, these glitches are insane. Max, that is crazy. Nathan is like one of my best friends. Yes, he takes serious meds, but that's not his fault. His family treats him like a total freak just because he has little meltdowns. They're not little anymore. They're deadly. I, I don't care if you hate me or not, but you have to believe me. You could have been a major bitch to me when I got hit with that paint, and I deserved it. Max, I don't hate you. I actually think you're one of the coolest people at Blackwell. Weird, but cool. You just don't know it yet. Maybe I'm jealous because you don't give a shit what anybody thinks, and I do. To be honest, Nathan has been freaking me out lately. He's not here, and I haven't seen him. Just make sure you stay away from him. And stick close to your friends tonight, okay? I let you boss me around this one time. And I have other people I can go to for protection. Thanks for telling me this, Max. If what you said is true, then you be careful too. I've got my own protection. Um, text me if you need anything. I will. Thanks, Victoria. Au revoir. Damn, so Nathan isn't even here. <coughs> this is creeping me out a bit. And there's Chloe. Maybe there's hope yet for Victoria and me. Oh good, Chloe's here. There's the party though. Chloe, Nathan oh, isn't here. Nobody has seen him tonight. He's definitely not upstairs or in the lockers. Damn. Maybe he's hiding in his dorm. Then let's bail. Nathan can't hide anymore. I don't blame so Nathan for hiding it. in his fucking oh, uh, dorm. Cause you guys hey, asked me. Mr. Jefferson. <laughs> Are you both okay? You look like you're on a, a mission. Oh, uh, I was just... Looking for Nathan. Come on, uh -huh. I'm recording right now. I, I didn't know you were pals with him. I haven't seen him since this afternoon. He he seemed pretty upset. I think he's still quite upset over the uh the whole oh, no. okay. Kate situation. Yeah, that makes sense. Right, Let's talk later, Max. Quick. I have to announce the winner of the contest. I do wish you would have entered. You have to build up that resume and portfolio, but I know you will. Thanks. I hope so. Okay, excuse me. I'm almost on. Let's get the hell out of here, Max.
Okay, okay, everybody calm down. Thank you, thank you. I appreciate it, but I don't want to get in the way of the party, but it's time to announce the winner of the Everyday Heroes Contest. Before I do, I want to thank everybody who entered their photograph and everybody who thought about entering. Now this is the most important step in being an artist. Sharing your work with the world. All of you represent Blackwell Academy and everything our school stands for. As far as I'm concerned, you're all everyday heroes. The envelope, please. And the winner is... Everything's glitching. Oh my, what a shocker. Victoria Chase. Mr. Jefferson, it was your incredible photography that brought me to Blackwell, and I hope I can live up to your Amen. name and fame. I also want to thank all the students for being so dedicated in their pursuit. And I'd like to dedicate this prize to Kate Marsh. <laughs> she is the real everyday hero of Blackwell, and I can't wait for her to come back. Thank you. Victoria won. Big surprise. I can't believe she blackmailed Jefferson. No. Yes, I can. Who fucking cares? Rachel is still dead, and I want Nathan's punk ass. Now. Me too. Let's go check out the dormitories. Oh, shit, I almost forgot that Nathan, yeah, we found out Nathan killed Rachel. Christ, Nathan just texted me. He says there won't be any evidence left after he's done. Shit. We have to go to the junkyard right now. Two moons? I almost forgot that happened too. around Chloe right just get ready to use your rewind fast if Nathan tries to jump us Glitching. Rachel. <laughs> Max, when we catch Nathan, you better rewind so I can kill him over and over. Oh, for God's sake, Chloe, you have to be quiet. We could die, okay? I don't remember where the spot Rachel, was. I will get your revenge. I swear. Oh, the spiders are here. Chloe, come over here, quick. Oh God, Max, look. She's still there. Don't look, Chloe. Can't even rewind. Chloe, look out. Can't even rewind.
fucking Na uh, that's not Nathan. That's not Nathan Prescott. What? Mr. Jefferson. Uh, best. Only forty five percent of us let Warren beat the shit out of Nathan. Well, that was the end of the of episode four. Shame I didn't do it on stream because one, it was already three hours long in this stream. Couldn't find a way into the damn vortex club, so I looked it up. Hopefully, I don't have to look anything up for episode five. Hopefully, next time I stream this game, um, the stream should already be in the playlist. This will be instantly put into playlists as soon as it's done. Um, yeah, episode 5 will be on stream, and then the day after that stream, y'all here on YouTube will get it. But that, it does suck. It really does suck. Um... Hopefully y'all did enjoy it. For me finishing part two of episode four. Um y'all enjoyed. Bad like and also turn on post notifications. I'll catch you on the next one.